there's a loose knit a network operating in this country involving drugs, pedophilia, pornography, prostitution, corruption, etc., etc. By the way, this conspiracy involves pornography, drugs, corruption, involves pedophilia, involves organized child kidnapping rings, the finders out of Washington, D.C., CIA cover, covert operation involved in the international trafficking of children, terrorism, bank accounts, and the word, and it goes on. So we have the Illuminati. Now the Illuminati uh, was established in 1776 by a fellow named Adam Weishaupt. In 1773, he was commissioned by one of the Rothschilds, uh, House of Rothschild, to put together an organization called the Illuminati. And he culminated his work in May the 1st, 1776. If you'll notice, that's a communist holiday. And uh, we're going to have to move along pretty fast. This is actually a four-hour lecture I'm going to give you today. We're going to do it in probably an hour and 15, 20 minutes. But some of his goals, uh, and the goals that he was commissioned to set up, there were 25 of them. And here they, they are right here. Here's the beginning of it right here. And rather than read each one of them, I'm going to summarize it, okay, because we've got a lot of work to get into. Number one issue was men are inclined to evil rather than good. Number two goal and issue was to preach liberalism. Number three, use the ideas of freedom to bring about class wars. That's what we're doing today. Number four, any and all means should be used to reach our goal uh, as they are justified, any and all means. Number five, their rights lie in force. That's we're talking about the Illuminati rights lie in force. Number six, the power of our resources must remain invisible until the very moment when it has gained the strength that no cunning or force can undermine it. And if you will notice, it's been a very, uh, no, very few people know about the Illuminati, so they have maintained their invisibility until most recently. Number seven, advocated mob psychology to obtain control of the masses. Number eight, use alcohol, drugs, moral corruption, and all forms of vice to systematically corrupt the youth of the nation.